I'll just go get through this bit. Um, which I don't think is is too bad. Might not be the hardest thing. Seeing if we're gonna find that hunter. He drops down from there, we'll see him a bit later, I guess. What's that? Is he doing my job for me? Just killing stuff. Still down there. Did they just kill him? And they might have done it. Nice. Um, okay, let's try and go down here. Let's try and something. Can we not actually parry those guys? So this might not actually be too bad because we've got a. We're actually doing some damage to them, so we can just kind of chain them down. was waiting for me and not this time got the old donkey kick to the face um it's up here that's the blood lake uh we've got this bit though a nice chunk and then we go in the cave and we find a hunter with a gatling gun shit <laughs> hey hard rock how's it going man how you doing That was close. That's a top up. Is he gonna use it? He's gonna use it. <laughs> oh, I thought that was it. That should have been it. We've got the Gatling gun. I've never used it. I've never used that before. Maybe another playthrough. That was a bit close. Too close. these mofos up. Of 
kind of want to get this before I get attacked by him. <laughs> Same as in a like the bus boss fight, just circle around his his left side, and he doesn't hear. You. Um, okay. There's loads of uh, gems down here as well. And we've got a uh, amygdala arm. Uh, I haven't even used that yet, either. But yeah, like even though I've got <laughs> Demon Souls to play, which I can't wait, I just want to get through this DLC now and start, like, continue to play that. Um, I still want to do some uh, New Game Plus runs on this, just to try out like all the uh, all the different weapon types. He survived. Item to not even fall on him. No. Oh crap. I'll get that over one. Nice, just spam those R ones. Uh, like literally, like boom hammer in this, ignite it, and do a jump and attack. Takes out, takes them out, knocks them flying. I think there's an item over here somewhere as well. I don't have to try it. <laughs> they just know. So you hear those things. Um, first time, uh, what was it in this playthrough going to Kanehurst with those everywhere? They were just absolutely annihilating me. There are jump attacks that do like 75% of my health in one hit. <laughs> Got some dags and another one. Oh, well, 
else do we have down here? This guy? And a hunter. Oh my god. Get out of there. This weapon's got range as well. I think I'm gonna run out of potions for this. Go in panic mode. Take him out with our ones. What? Sure, I'll not risk this. I'll kill one. One crow with my molly. <laughs> Brilliant. But these ones are a lot more aggressive. All these little poor souls. of a weapon. Uh, I don't know if to risk this one or not. I've only got a few things. Uh, yeah, let's do it. Can't be that hard, are you? He's got red eyes. Get out of there. Heal. Can we get a, a parry through there? No, of course not. We need to like, get around him. Vermin. <sighs> um, but yeah, I mean, like these, uh, those guys, they're not. I mean, like you might be able to stagger them with a heavier weapon. But with this one, with the bone saw, it's not happening. Can we get up there? Wrong. No. So I think there's an item on the other side we can like drop down onto one of them planks, planks of wood. And go across. Constable's garb. Brilliant. What we always wanted. And there's nothing else over there. Oh, coming up to my uh, favourite boss soon. Should have had a look over there actually. See the big guy come out around the corner, and then his friend. Oh, 
fuck this. <laughs> just run past those. No point in doing those just yet. And go straight to the lantern. Oh god. Because we've got some other bits to deal with as well. We've got 200. Oh, is it worth it? I might just... Uh, Go, uh, actually, I'll try and clear around here first. So I think down here we've got a, uh, a summon. Uh, Henriette. It's uh, quite a few chunks in this area though. Please. Can we just shoot at him? Oh, my bullets. Time those is um it's not too sp uh, hard. It's just space. You kind of panic a bit going across these rooftops. But he's got like a long wind up to his swing. We got crows. Swing, swing at anything. <laughs> okay, usually with crows, if you hear a crow, it means it's in your, it, you're in its line of, it, you're in its path of attack. So just roll, and then you're good. Most of the time. shells everywhere. Ah, Whirly Gigsaw. <clears throat> um, I think that one's there. S. Scaling with strength. A nice, uh, nice weapon to have. <sighs> really fun to play around with. <sighs> right, let's see if we can survive. I don't want to... <clears throat> Going here for a minute. There is a there is a summon in that area. I'm not sure what triggers it. Whoa, he's got combos, and I'm stuck. Oh shit. Shot one his little friend to come as well. Right, okay. We're at a point where we've got some some echoes. Let's go back, level up, and then take on those guys. Because uh, we do have a boss coming up for real soon. What's of many guys. <laughs> Minus three, 17. Let's get that. Let's get that one in there. Uh, okay, and we've got so the usual stuff. Max HP, max stamina, frenzy resist. Actually, I think I might change this one. Frenzy resist. I don't know if we have much, if we need to worry about frenzy that much in here. I'm just going to go for less damage.
<clears throat> but yeah, I've, I've got like, um, so I'm playing this on the PlayStation 5 and I just realised like, there's not going to be any difference because it's not installed on the actual hard uh, drive of the PlayStation. So it's just going to be the same as playing it on a uh, PS4, I guess. Uh, no slowdowns, I guess. For frames. So it's that point where Cullen I like has the echo effect on his axe. Oh what? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that should have killed me then. Silver bullets, six blood vials. Nice. Oh but yeah, those those guys are annoying. So what um I don't know what activates that summon. Maybe it's after we die a bunch of times. Is there anything else around here? Some madman's knowledge. Nice. I think that's that's it for around this area. Some more blood vials. Basically, you're going to die. Stock up. Uh, now this guy, this guy look banging on the gate. It's just a corpse, but you can kill this one. And I, I think he drops like five health blood vials every time. So you can kind of like replenish all the ones you're about to lose in the next area. Uh, what's good with this guy? Oh, pardon me, should we some beast blood? Some bolt paper. Acting as if we're good. Acting as if we know what we're doing. Here it goes. This is one ugly motherfucker. Ah, you were at my side. 
all along. Just that laugh. I was meant to stay with him for that and out for this one. That's it. That might have been a bit too loud. <laughs> Sorry about the volume, guys. Uh, but yeah, that fight on New Game Plus, like any of the New Game Pluses, is a, a nightmare. Literally, it's so... It's solid. It was solid for me, anyway. I have to have a few attempts. Uh, even that was sloppy. I wouldn't have made it if I had played like that in New Game Plus. Uh, New Game Plus 2... <laughs> um, but yeah, like the idea for that is, uh, I'll have a quick talk about it in case anyone needs to know. Uh, so for the first phase, when it's on all fours or sixes or whatever, um, his weak point is his ribs at the side. You don't want to go to the back of him and stay out of the front and just kind of like uh, dodge around to the side, get a few attacks in and hopefully it would stagger and then you can get a few more attacks in or just hang around and recover. Um, if you if you go out to range and you do some crazy like jump attacks uh, and a charge as well, you will eventually like back off and do those but the idea is to get as much damage in to him straight away to push him into second phase. Um, that's when he gets a sword. So in second phase, uh, same again, Ren really try and stay close to him and then just dodge around him try and get to his back when he does his uh, sword swings um I, I don't know whether it's easier to like just dodge uh to the direction that he's swinging from and then just go back and forth with those or just uh keep dodging around you might be able to make it to his back and then he you can stagger him by attacking his legs and getting a visceral on the front of his body when he plunges his sword down, move away. Uh, when he lifts his sword up, just stay around his back because he attacks forward. You just get a little bit of damage, um, area damage when he first lifts his sword up, but just get back in and get to his back. Uh, and that's the fight, really. Uh, I, I believe is more, like, slightly more weak to bolt. The ball and fireworks, pretty good, pretty well. Good hunter, have you seen the thread of light? Just a hair, a fleeting thing. Yet I clung to it, steeped as I was in the stench of blood and beasts. I never wanted to know what it really was. Really, I didn't. I 
with the Far Cry. <laughs> I think that might be a new, uh, a new follow, <laughs> follow sound. It was a little bit too long though. I might just uh, say, I, I just wanted to get that in there so I can save it. And clip it down. Uh, these guys, I don't think they mean anything. You, you can pretty much just kill these. Um, put him out of his misery as well. What did we get? Oh, okay. Kill him for the Holy Moonlight Sword, of course. Oh, God. One of the best, like my favourite weapon in the game anyway. I can't use it. But it's nice, it glows blue. Ah, uh, slide that lamp and continue on.